A nanny heads to court and wait till you hear why. She's accused of stealing her employer's cat named Tigger. Now she's talking to Inside Edition saying she has no regrets about the catnapping. This nanny is willing to go to jail for a cat. Yes, a cat. And it's not even hers. Rebecca Katz, yep, that's her real last name, admits to swiping the kitty named Tigger from her employer. But she says it was for the cat's own good. She says the mom she worked for threatened to put the cat to sleep. The day that I took him, um, she said, yeah, he's going to be put down. Say goodbye to him. Rebecca was arraigned on petty larceny charges in court today outside New York City. Rebecca Katz worked as a nanny at this house. She says the mom more than once threatened to give the cat the needle, reportedly because it suffered from stomach and other health issues. Rebecca says she offered to take the 15-year-old tabby cat off the family's hands, but that they refused. I left a note on the counter saying, I'm sorry, I can't let you do this. I have to take him. I know he's not sick. Rebecca cared so much about the cat, she gave up her job when she walked away with Tigger. The family went to police, and Rebecca turned herself in. You said you'd be willing to go to jail and sleep with the cockroaches over this issue. Yeah, I, I did say that, and I, I would. Julie and Russell Berman, Tigger's owners, were in court today but declined to comment. Did you threaten to have the cat euthanized? As for the nanny, she gets to keep Tigger till the case is resolved. The nanny says she's already spent $1,000 on medical bills for the cat. She claims her vet could find no serious illness.